Hello? I need to search this office for any communication with Sarah that can help me find her. Arcadia Bay's least wanted. What do we have here? I should check the computer, or some of those files laying around. I should check the computer, or some of those files laying around. If it can rain ash, I guess it could snow in LA. <laughs> it's the big one. James has a file on Frank. I'd love to read this, but I've got to focus on finding Rachel's mom. James has a file on Frank. I'd love to read this, but I've got to focus on finding Rachel's mom. Best dad? <laughs> that stuff is all politics anyway. Hmm. Sweet. A secret key. Now to find the secret lock. I feel like I've heard that name before. I guess getting your ass kissed comes with the DA territory. <laughs> Pro tip, when digging for secrets, try the DA. Even if James is trying to protect Rachel from her mother, this seems like a pretty terrible way to act. James sure keeps lots of files on people. More sherry. <sighs> More sherry.
Welcome to Shadyville. to know who James is talking to on the secret phone of his. It could be about Sarah. James is working with Damon Merrick? This is insane. What were they talking about? Is the girl Damon's talking about Sarah? Whatever is going on, I need to see if Damon knows where Sarah is. But how do I get him to tell me? say hope James actually has this evidence don't think Damon will tell me where Sarah is unless I send him a picture Sheldon. Why do I feel like I've heard that name before? James sure keeps lots of files on people. Sarah sent all these letters, and James never gave them to Rachel? That's so messed up. Sarah in this letter doesn't seem anything at all like the person James told us about last night.
So, this looks like Sarah stopped cashing the checks James sent her. Guess he forgot to mention that during his story last night. is Damon talking about? I could just take a wild guess and see what he says. Or maybe there's some info on the case hanging around the office. Huh. If TV has taught me anything, these babies will be swimming in DNA. Could this be the evidence? Damon and Knives seem like a solid bet. Did Damon really shoot someone? Guess I shouldn't be surprised. If I can figure out how. How do I destroy a glove? Maybe I can burn it somehow. Hope James doesn't really get Damon off the hook. That dude's gotta pay. that again. I hope James has something here to tell me who Damon's informant is. So I need to find which of Damon's guys has been snitching? I should search around the office to see if there's any info to help me out. Arcadia Bay's least wanted. Arcadia Bay's least wanted.
Okay. If I'm going to accuse one of these guys, I'd better be sure I'm right. Guess this explains why Mr. Amber knows so much about Frank. Could this douchebag be the snitch Damon's talking about? This guy let me into the mill. Cool dude. I totally knew this guy was a criminal when I stole from him. Been learning a hell of a lot about Frank lately. Okay, there's no way that Frank is snitching on Damon. But I love learning about his badass loitering charge. Feels a little weird having this guy's records at my finger. This is that freak from the mill. Wonder what Damon would think of his very cooperative comment. Guess I'm lucky James keeps so much info at home. I agree to aid the courts on future cases. <laughs> that could be seen as a little snitchy. This is that freak from the mill. Wonder what Damon would think of his very cooperative comment. Payment? Here's hoping James already has Damon's money. <sighs> Hope James doesn't really get Damon off the hook. That dude's gotta pay. <sighs> More sherry. Sarah sent th so this looks like Sarah stopped cashing the checks James sent her. Guess he forgot to mention that during his story last night. I wonder if this has anything to do with Damon's stash.
Holy shit. That must be thousands of dollars. No wonder Damon wants it so bad. Fuck, that's Sarah. And she's at the mill. What is he doing to her? Does James even know what he's doing? Okay, I still have time. Damon's waiting for his money, right? He wouldn't do anything to her. Yet. Fuck. I need to get there fast. Chloe? Elliot? Hey! Elliot, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? This is Rachel's house, right? Did he really just follow me here? I can't really talk about it. Rachel... Rachel needs my help. I'm sure she does. I'm more concerned about you. I'm fine. You're the one acting crazy. You shouldn't be here. Chloe, what is... Ah. Elliot, put that down. You have no idea what you're dealing with. And you do? Chloe, God, what have you gotten yourself into? You... You wouldn't understand. Give me a chance. What the hell are you doing? I can't talk much about it. It has to do with Rachel's mother. Her real mother. And that explains you breaking into the DA's home and having this? Believe it or not, yes. I'm so sick of you not seeing who Rachel really is. When will you realize what she's doing to you? Elliot, just... Take a step back. No! You need to listen to me. What has your relationship with her gotten you? You... You don't know what you're talking about. First night you hang out, what happens? You end up in a fight. You don't know what you're talking about. Rachel saved my ass. I'm sure that's how it seemed to you. Stop, stop suggesting that she's somehow bad The for... next day she convinces you to skip school. Magically, she barely gets in trouble. And you get suspended. I took the fall because I wanted to. Rachel tried to protect me. Yet somehow, it all worked out for her in the end. As usual. You don't understand. You weren't there! Was she protecting you when she made you take part in a play you didn't want to be in? S seriously, man. You, you need to shut the fuck up before- I've been quiet long enough! Look, Rachel is an amazing actress. And I don't mean on stage. She's fake. You're real. And I hate to see her manipulate you like this. Elliot. I, I promise, no one is manipulating me. No? Just look where you are now. A high school dropout. Hanging out with criminals and breaking into houses. It's crazy! It just as easily could have been you in that hospital today. If that ever happened...
Look, I, I hear you. I, I appreciate the concern. I don't think you do. Elliot. I'm the one who cares about you, Chloe. Me, not Rachel. It's time you saw the truth. What does that mean? It means you're going to stop thinking about Rachel and pay attention to me now, for once. Elliot, please. I know you're upset, but... Uh, I'm not upset! I'm trying to help you. Elliot's gone full-blown crazy. I... I need to get the police to come without tipping him off. Who was there for you? When Max left? When your dad died? No one else gave a shit about you except for me! We have a lot to talk about. And I don't care how long it takes. We're not leaving until you see that I'm right. All right, Elliot. You want to talk so bad? Let's talk. What's really going on here? You can tell me. You mean here? Specifically? Like, uh, the Amber House? I'm talking about your situation. Rachel is dangerous. You need to realize that. You're right, Elliot. I didn't want to admit it before, but it's true. My life is in danger. Thank you, Chloe. All I want is to help you. I'm glad you can finally see that. You're right. This whole thing has been a cry for help. Help me. Help me now. Hey, it's okay. I'm not going anywhere. I feel trapped. Boxed in. I desperately want to leave this situation. It takes a lot of guts to tell me all this. And I want you to know that I will always be there for you, no matter what. It's the police. Okay, don't panic. Uh... I'm sure they'll just want to ask us why we're here. What do we do? I'll talk to them. Uh, shit, um, there's nothing to be concerned about. Thank you, Elliot. You're a great friend. <laughs> 